All right, we got a beautiful sunset going on late on a Friday night in January. And I don't know that I've ever showed this car before. It's kind of a shop car, customer deal. The backstory is I did a bunch of service on this rig, uh, new brakes and tune-up about five years ago. Belonged to a good customer of mine. It's an all-wheel drive, 2000 Astro. And then he proceeded to run into a semi truck or sideswipe the semi truck. Uh, anyhow, broke the rear window out, uh, the front fender is damaged. I uh, broke the front glass out here and the front fender. Uh, but I knew vehicle history. I gave him probably too much money for it. I think I paid 600 bucks for it, which was a lot. I had brand new brakes and tires. I figured I could take the body off and make a a gambler, a gambler 500 is what they call that. Stella wants to go gambling. You want to go on the gambler, gambler 500? Oh, see a bird up there. So I've been working on it a little bit. Uh, the four wheel drive wasn't working. I put a new um, encoder motor in it. Um, transfer case checked out, put an encoder motor in it, did another tune up. Um, and now I'm stripping out all the stinky carpets and sitting around the shop behind the back of the shop for a long time. And of course the windows out of it, the doors don't shut in the back. So the carpet was just nasty and it weighs like 500 pounds. It's all piled up right there. I don't know. It might make a good hauler for a microcar. It actually is wide enough that I could fit a microcar in there. I'm not sure if it's tall enough. I'm going to do something with it. And I don't know. I've got a lot of projects going on, but I got to do I got to start doing something with it. <laughs> it's got a hitch. It's kind of nice. It's got the 4.3 V6 Vortec. 4.3 is what they call it. And uh, 153,000 miles. The speedometer went wonky. It's pegged. Uh, but uh, it's all there. And uh, we always look for adventure around here. So I don't know what will happen. But just wanted to get this baseline video out there and let you know that we're we might cut the back off, make it a flatbed. I don't know. It doesn't have a frame, so I'm a little concerned about structural integrity. Let's see what we can do with this thing. Maybe it will become a donor for um, one of the microcars. Who knows? So stay in touch. Subscribe to my channel. Check me out. See what, what happens here. We don't know.